Hello everyone, I'm Kara. I go out of my comfort zone and try my first video in English. I have seen that many of you are from different countries and that's why I made that decision to speak in English now. As you can see, I used this rose pink mica powder for the first layer. I will work uh, with different layers here. Just use one drop of resin and mix it with the mica powder. And use a little bit more of resin. That wasn't enough. Mix it again. Make sure the whole silicone mold is full of resin. And harden it now for 60 seconds. For the second layer we need another drop of resin. Make sure you fill the whole silicone mold with it. I use this chunky glitter in this form to make the dragon scales. I decided to choose another color, so the scales are looking a little bit different. You don't have to choose the same basic color as I used here, but in my opinion it's good uh, to choose the same color as the bottom is. I will show you now the whole part of the first layer. Place it one by one. It took a little bit more time, but uh, the result will be very nice at the end. You really need some patience for this part, but it's worth it. Sometimes I'm a little bit in trouble with my cam. You see, <laughs> it's uh, jumping up and down, but uh, I try to improve it.
and I hope you like my German slang. Remember, it's my first video. I speak English in it. You can tell me in the comments if you like my German English. You can help me to decide uh, if I make another video in this language or not. And now we are done with the second layer. And we harden it again for another 60 seconds. So the so third layer, we place uh, small sheets a little bit different as before. Oh, that's Pico. He says, please subscribe my channel if you haven't already done it yet. You can see here we do nearly the same thing as in the last part. I will show you now a little animation in the left upper corner how I exactly placed the sheets. It's important that we can see the layer we made before, otherwise it makes no sense that we make another layer. Sorry, I tried to show you more details um, uh, with the zoom of my camera, but um, <laughs> I've seen she, uh, the camera isn't uh, very good at that. Let's harden it again. So, welcome to the last hard part of this whole thing. We do uh, nearly the same as uh, before. I will show you a little animation soon. So here is the animation. I try to close the holes in the uh, last layer of the sheets. So we come slowly to the end of the resin part. I added as much resin as fit in in this silicone mold. And use a fire against the bubbles. Now I hardened it, but I um, made it more than 60 seconds because uh, we needed it before a little bit sticky. But now for the finish, it should be fully cured. It's time to pull it out of the silicone mold. You can start now the sanding and uh, 
finish it um, with resin, with a layer of resin, um, so that it uh, looks a little bit bulbous. Uh, one thing what you cannot see here is that I sanded the edges and don't touch it uh, with the resin again. I like, uh, I really like the look, uh, but uh, you can do as you want. I mix here the same color uh, like in the beginning because I want to make some pearls out of it. I fit so much resin as I could in it, but at the end, sadly, there were no whole pearls. I don't know why. Maybe you know the answer. If so, please write that in the comments. So we are nearing the end. Please like this video if you want and if you liked it. I have a second channel. If you are interested in card readings, you can take a look. I will um, put the link in the info box. As you can hear, I used no music in this video. If you are a music artist, you can write to me Take a look at the channel info. There you can find my email. If you have an own YouTube video channel and used my video as inspiration, I really would be happy if you send me this link.